Chris Curry from Anchorage in Alaska wants to know whether regular people, by, by which he means I think people who are not scientifically trained, can still contribute to scientific understanding in a way that I suppose he feels that they could in the past before everything became so technical. I think it's uh, on the one hand not possible uh, to think in a productive or an effective way about science without studying, without mastering the subject. I mean, uh, any, what we do, indeed most of the science uh, that goes on, is uh, understandable by uh, and could be pursued, uh, I think, by an ordinary, by any ordinary person. There's nothing so profound uh, that it requires any uh, very rare aptitude to grasp and to do. So the answer is on the one hand uh, that, it, that are what the questioner refers to as an ordinary person uh, would have to be willing to invest, to learn, and to understand. But at the same time, any ordinary person would be capable of doing it. Uh, I would add to that that I think it's terribly important for all ordinary people uh, to learn about and understand uh, chemistry and the particular types of thing we and others do. Uh, as I have said to you earlier on, there's really nothing more uh, valuable uh, to the life of any person than to have some conception of the chemical basis for all of what goes on around us.